this is Dr. Claude, and I'm thinking about protein for my workout. I'm running the track here at this lake in Las Vegas, and I do at least half of my workouts in terms of cardio versus strength as strength training. And I want to maintain my muscle tissue. How much protein do I need to do that? Very interesting answer. Turns out that the timing of your protein is way more important than how much you eat. If you only ate one meal a day, you would need 10 times the amount of protein than what the recommended dietary allowances tell us. But if you ate protein every few hours, it turns out that a strength athlete only needs 10 to 20% more protein than a sedentary person. Let me repeat that, 10 to 20% more than a sedentary person. Why is that? Because when you paste your protein so that it comes in at a rate that your muscles can keep absorbing it, you're gonna build muscle tissue. The body does not have any storage site for protein. So when you don't eat some protein every few hours, it starts to go into the starved state, your body uses its own muscle tissue as a protein source. So if you're not really too worried about being really strong, recovering as fast as possible from your workouts, getting protein in each of your three meals a day is just fine. But if you're an athlete, you want to push yourself to your limits, have some protein every few hours, but you don't need that much. That's Dr. Clyde Stott on Sports Nutrition. I'll see you next time.